Herman. Seriously? Give it up! You're never gonna catch me! That's what you said last time. I don't wanna hurt you! You'll just pull me down! Wow, that's considerate. What's the money for, Herman? Why do you care? Actually, I don't. I'm just trying to make polite conversation. I'm done talking! But this could be so much more rewarding if we connected on an emotional level. Wait, I forgot. You don't have emotions. <laughs> Come on, Herman. At least talk to me so we can make it interesting. <laughs> gotcha. Now let's talk. I said I'm done. Noted. Honestly, Herman, why are you robbing again? You know the police are watching your every move. I mean, we all know you're kind of dumb, but I didn't think you were this dumb. You must be desperate, which means you're not just stealing for yourself. You must be working with someone, or for someone. You can tell me who it is now, or make me punch it out of you later. Your choice. Not enough. Move, move, move! Zero personality, but your suit is awesome. Can we talk design details? <laughs> Maybe later. Good work, Spider-Man. Did you learn anything about his motive? I tried, but he's not very talkative. Plus, I think he hates me. You have that effect on a lot of people. But you love me, right, Yuri? I tolerate you. Wow. That might be the nicest thing you've ever said to me. It looks like I got some free time. Maybe now's a good time to look into that mask. Oh, it's MJ. <clears throat> hey, MJ. You're up late. Just catching up on the news. Looks like you had quite an adventure with Shocker tonight. Yeah, he was unusually combative. Anyway, thanks again for dinner. What do I owe you? How about a favor? You still have that mask from the gallery? Yeah. I'm actually on my way to the Feast Center now to ask Martin Lee about it. Martin Lee? Why? He has a degree in art history. If anyone knows about the origins of that mask, he will. Just keep me in the loop. Like I said, I think there's a bigger story here, and I plan to be the one to break it. Uh, sure. So I can call you, like, whenever? Yeah, whenever, whatever. So I guess we're talking again. Cool.
might have heard about the robbery at Roseman's auction house. What you probably didn't hear, but my sources confirm, is that the perpetrators were wearing masks. Horrible, demonic faces. Yet another example of the explosion in mass criminals since Spider-Man came on the scene. Let's hear your thoughts. You're on with J. Jonah Jameson. Yeah, I see your point, but Spider-Man stopped those guys today. Saying he's like them because he wears a mask isn't fair. It's like prejudice. Wrong. Here's a little lesson in the English language, my friend. Prejudice means to prejudge someone before you know anything about them. I know all I need to about Spider-Man. He runs around causing chaos, wearing a mask so he doesn't have to answer for his shenanigans, and a flashy costume so he gets attention to feed his gigantic, insatiable ego. Now, if I'm a mentally unstable person, and I see him getting all this coverage, what am I going to do? It's called cop... Are you okay, ma'am? Carmen, and I'm fine. It's my husband, Rodrigo. He's been acting weird, and I just found out he's meeting this woman. Well, listen, I'm not the best person to help with relationship problems. It's not like that. I think she's involved with bad people. Rodrigo might be in real trouble. He's scared, but he won't tell me anything. I can check it out. Any idea when he's meeting her next? Tonight, by the detox center in Greenwich. Okay. Don't worry, Carmen. I'll find out what's going on. Detox center's not far. Carmen just sent me Rodrigo's picture. Let's see if I can find him. Rodrigo. He's really nervous. That woman doesn't seem like a girlfriend. I'll get a photo and see if Carmen recognizes her. You better not hold anything back. Why would I? Bad angle. You need to get it straight on. Life's over. Give me the plans and it won't. Very nice. Gotcha. Looks good. Remember, tell anyone about this, and I leak the photo. Plans. This sounds bigger than I thought. I better follow the blackmailer and find out how big. Carmen, I'm uploading a photo to you. Does this woman look familiar? No, I've never seen her. What were they talking about? Sounds like she's blackmailing him. She mentioned something about plans. My husband works security at a casino in Atlantic City. Let me know if I can help. All right, I'm gonna see where she's taking the plans. I'll be in touch. Another victim or an accomplice? I need a photo. No perches with a good angle on this new guy. Looks like it's the underside of the High Line. Another victim or an accomplice? I need a photo. No perches with a good angle on this new guy. Looks like it's the underside of the High Line.
nice clear image. Gotta catch my train. I wanna keep the boss with me. That's gonna be our biggest score yet. Hell yeah. How many people are in on this? I've gotta follow him. Where's he getting off? Uh, tapping into the train system should help me follow the train's path. Carmen, the blackmailer met some guy under the High Line. It sounded like he knew your husband. I'm sending you the photo. That's Deshaun, Rodrigo's best friend from college. He went to prison years ago in a robbery charge. Casino plans and a criminal record. Not a great combination. I need to find out who else is in on it. If they're hitting the casino, they'll need at least a wheelman and a safe cracker. I watch a lot of high school movies. Sounds like it. I'll let you know what I find out. head over near the subway and just wait for him to get out. <laughs> Roman's ready and we are running late. Let's roll. They're on the move. I have all the evidence I need. Now I just have to stop that car.
love it when a plan falls apart. Hey, Carmen. Your husband's pal and his team just had their trip to beautiful Atlantic City canceled. Thank you. I spoke to Rodrigo. That blackmail photo shows him driving the night Deshaun committed the robbery. But Rodrigo didn't know about it. He was just picking up his friend. I've got a contact on the force. She'll help Rodrigo. Especially if he'll agree to testify about the blackmail. He will. Or I'll show him he needs to be a lot more afraid of me than Deshaun. Thanks, Spider-Man. I have to once again defend myself against the spurious claims from McDonald Mac Gargan, a.k.a. The Scorpion. Yes, as I fully disclosed, I bankrolled the experiment that gave him superior strength, speed, and that unsightly cyborg tail. The idea was to create an anti-Spider-Man who is not a threat and stops menaces. I had no idea he was crazy. Do you think his resume said psycho with a poisoning fetish? His lawsuit is a transparent attempt to reduce his sentence at the raft by placing the blame for his deeds on me. And that is one package J. Jonah Jameson refuses. Almost morning. Mr. Lee will be here soon. I could use a snack. Mr. Lee's usually in his office now. You guys holding up all right? This moron thinks I'm going to move in with my daughter. Hey, that'd be great. She hasn't asked, and she's not gonna. I'm not going anywhere. You don't know that. Nobody does. Well, I'm not going anywhere. That's a promise. Peter, how are you? Even more explosions and a barrage of gunfire coming from 
inside the building after Spider-Man and the NYPD had moved in, which lasted much longer than police had hoped. Peter, what can I do for you? I'm sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. Well, she wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. Let's see what you have. Interesting. Where did she find it? I'm really not sure. Why? What is it? A replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. Demon? Well, my father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. Scared the hell out of me. Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? I don't know. Why take the risk? Hey. The symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. Never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, that makes sense. Demons, huh? Catchy name. Okay, gotta get writing. See you soon. Well, that went about as well as I could have hoped. Got some time to kill before Doc needs me at the lab. Let's do a little spidey work out in the city. Story Mary Jane's investigating. Don't worry, I'll make sure she's careful. Please tell me you two are back together. We're talking again. Baby steps. I hope I didn't upset Mr. Lee. He's just concerned. I was actually touched by how concerned. 
I knew he liked you. He admires how dedicated you are to helping others. I think you remind him of himself when he was younger. Both orphans, both so smart. Well, the admiration's mutual. You've got a good boss, May. I'll tell him you said so. Love you, Peter. Hello? Peter, it's Dr. Octavius. Oh, hey, what's up? Lance Corporal Texador is here for a fitting. I totally forgot. I mean, I mean, I didn't forget, forget, I just... I, I'll be there soon. <sighs> His tardiness is starting to become a pattern. Come on, Parker. You're better than this. <sighs> He's right. How did I lose track of time? Something wrong? Oh, no, no. I just had to thank you for saving my daughter from those muggers. Uh, when did this happen? Just now. <sighs> Busy guy like you. I guess it all blurs together, huh? Near the theater on 126 and Powell. She just called and told me. Right. Sorry. Uh, happy to help. I'm glad your daughter's safe. Okay, I wasn't anywhere near there. I should swing by and see what's going on. Taxi! Taxi! There's the theater, and the crime scene. I better find out what happened. Still alive. So whoever did this isn't a lethal protector. That's promising. Sorry I missed the action. Thanks for keeping it safe, Spider-Man. You're back already? I thought you were checking out that fire. Right. Uh, on my way now. Which way was it again? Last time you went that way. South. Thanks. I got a little turned around. Someone's impersonating me. It could be the chameleon again. I've got to pick up his trail. It does smell like there was a fire in this direction. There's the fire damage. Looks like it got put out quickly. He used the fire escape. Guess he couldn't copy my web shooters. Hey, Spidey, what'd you do with that fire extinguisher? Fire extinguisher, huh? Wonder where he left it. You came back! I can't thank you enough for saving my friend from the fire. I thought she was dead. My pleasure. Look. I want to make sure everyone's safe, but the smoke kind of got to me. Do you remember where I went next? Sorry, I was helping my friend. I think you went back up there. Thanks. I give your friend my best. Whoever foe Spider-Man is, he's helping people. But what he's doing is dangerous. I've got to find him. My doppelganger used a fire extinguisher. Might still be around here. He used a fire extinguisher. What type of suppressant is in this?
ADP. Pretty standard. And easy to track. He got fire suppressant on him. If I key my lenses to track its chemical signature, it should lead me right to Spider-Man 2.0. He's walking normally. No webs, no powers. Which makes what he's doing suicidal. Pardon me! Looks like he's been in a fight. Maybe he knows something. Come on, man, lay off! I told you everything. The deal's going down on the roof. No lie. Right, just... you stay out of trouble. Hope I'm not too late. My doppelganger's got some skills. And he left the drugs. Seems like his intentions are good, even if his methods are nuts. The police will handle the cleanup. Counterfeit Spidey must have gone down the other fire escape. Where'd you learn to fight like that? I told you, I give up. That's gonna leave a mark. That's him. People seem to like him. Yeah, I mean me. I, I mean, oh, this is weird. My pleasure, citizens. Excuse me. I hear someone in need. Okay, I do not talk like that. Nobody talks like that. Let him go. Yeah, right. We'll get even more from Mr. Fisk when we bring him your head. Whoa, hey guys! I'm not the real Spider-Man. Not anymore, you're not. Time to even the odds a little. Got this. Go. You miss a chance to team up with the real Spider-Man? No way. You know how to fight. Teach at your car dojo. I just wanted to help you spread the legend out. Yeah, but when you dress like me, you inherit my enemies, and I've got a lot of enemies. I'll take the ones with guns. You get the rest. nearby and I'm sure folks would appreciate free self-defense classes good idea intense how do you do it one bruise at a time look your heart's in the right place but if you keep this up you're gonna get killed yeah i see that now don't worry i'm hanging up the suit spider-man no more good call besides you don't need a costume to make a difference 
Hey, that's a good line. I'll remember that. I've always been about the truth. When I was a reporter and a newspaper publisher, I printed the truth. But now, as a broadcaster, I speak with you. Sometimes it hurts. But it's my responsibility to bring it to you. And the truth is, the city's not quiet. It is not peaceful. It is a disaster waiting to happen. Threats roiling under the surface, like a hungry shark just beneath the waterline. Don't let Spider-Man You are not safe. None of us are. 